southwest coast path, 630 miles, mine head to pool. What could possibly go wrong? Start of the southwest coast path, let's get hiking. Hiking malarkey is really easy. Five minutes out of my head and we're already climbing. First acorns. We're on a national trail. So yeah, I am taking a break, 20 minutes after starting. I'm straight up Minehead, there's a couple of quite uh, quite uphill switchbacks. And get your heart rate up a bit. Definitely feeling my calves. Calves are uh, telling me it's hard work already. Possibly because I've been training with about 10 kilograms. And my pack weight for this walk is 13 and a half kilograms or 30, 30 pounds. Um, and I'm feeling that difference. I'm feeling that extra three and a half kilograms at the moment. So, um, quick break and then uh, back up the hill. So, uh, while I'm here, sat out the wind, um, just would like to uh, ask the South West Coast Path Association if they thought it was a good idea to start the trail and then two minutes down the road put a pub. Um, it's obviously the law to stop and have a pint at every pub you pass. Don't blame me, I don't write the law, I'm just abiding by it. So, I stopped and had a pint two minutes into the walk. Southwest Coast Path Association move the monument that starts it past the pub and then we can all get a good start rather than walking for two minutes stopping for a drink carrying on again it's your fault clearly not mine for being weak just coming out of the uh, forest now looks like I'm about to hit daylight Sunshine on my face. choice now, I can either carry on the, uh, the main route, the coast path, or I can follow the rugged coast path, which according to the guidebook is half a mile longer but takes no more time. Decisions. Traditional path, rugged path. 
So, yep, I uh, took the rugged path in the end. Clearly that was a mistake. Uh, and I should have took the easier route. I don't know if you can see, but the trail goes down and down to the dip and then up. And up the side up there. guys it's been a great day today 10 miles and a little bit because of the rugged path option um, an extra half an hour I reckon that was in the end so not too bad sun's just setting over Porlock Weir I'm currently in Porlock at Sparkay's campsite really decent site uh, it's got a bit of a kitchen it's got an area a covered area to sit under if it's raining decent showers decent toilets not a bad price average really, £9 for the night. Three pubs and a shop in walking distance. That's all you need really. So tomorrow is meant to absolutely throw it down all day. So if you enjoy watching other people's misery, it's probably going to be a good watch tomorrow. I'm not going to beg for likes or subscribes. Yes I am. Uh, I won't do it any more than this video. But yeah, if you want to... Um, Carry along with me, see how the southwest coast path goes. Um, you're welcome to. Hopefully, show you a lot of beauty, a lot of views, but also kind of the, the reality of long distance hiking. And try not to sugarcoat it too much. guys last video of the night um, just been to the shop got a few beers there 
Uh, been to a couple of pubs in uh, Porlock, both decent pubs. Um, and this will see me through for the night. Um, forecast still looking terrible for tomorrow. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll call it a night. It's been a really, well, not really, start again, bloody hell. But yeah, if you want to um, carry along with me, see how the south coast west, blah, blah. start again. I'm currently in Porlock, at, um, I'll think of the name in a minute. Damn it, can't think of the name. So currently in Porlock at, oh, I forgot it again. Video.